committee, they're, they're absolutely insane what, what these whistleblowers are alleging, that they wanted to investigate Hunter Biden in 2018, um, and, and the, the DOJ was slow walking it, not allowing the investigators to do their job, wouldn't give them a search warrant, they had tons of probable cause, um, and, and then eventually actually suspended the whole investigation ahead of the 2020 election because it could hurt Joe Biden. Um, and then once he was elected, they redid, they re-upped the investigation, um, but were again hindering it every step of the way. The, the IRS investigators wanted to do a consented search of Hunter's home. They wanted to do some really key interviews. And before they were going to do it, the FBI actually tipped off people really close to Joe and Hunter um, before their day of action, basically thwarting the entire thing, um, and then eventually then ending the whole investigation. So twice they did that. So this is an explosive story that is implicating uh, implicating Joe Biden, Hunter Biden, and then, of course, the deep state, which has been protecting them all along. And in in the midst of all of this, um, we, we, we have this, this giant story. Suddenly, we have this Russia coup. Um, hit the headlines and it's been w extremely overemphasized by the corporate media by the white house by the department of defense um and and i i think it's and this is people will say oh you're a conspiracy theorist you're crazy um this is what the media does all the time we already know that they don't want the american people to know about these irs whistleblower testimonies every democrat on the house ways and means committee Want, voted to not make them public. Um, so th this is this is textbook behavior. And I'll, I'll say this about the coup. I, I, I think that attempted coup. I think that it's a it's a serious matter. I think it has a place in the world news section. It should, it's not that it shouldn't be covered. It's that it shouldn't dominate the headlines when we have a Biden bribery scandal and potential uh, DOJ interference in in the in the the rule of law in our country. I and mean, this is so serious, and it's not being covered by a media that is continuing to protect the, the president and show preferential treatment to one side